And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, at the microphone. And sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And we have live action from the Pro League coming up next. It is Charleroi facing Anderlecht. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. This is the lineup for the home team. Well, it looks like they're going to play in a 3 4 3 formation without wing backs, which means the outside centre halves will need to cover the areas out wide, which I would say is asking a lot. This is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Well, in this formation, the wide centre-backs need to be good all-round players, both in possession and defensively. They have to defend the box and also get out into the wide areas to cover the wing-backs. And now they get the ball rolling. Michael Murillo. It's with Rafailov. Can he take advantage? Oh, he's done it! But hang on, offside is the verdict here. It's not going to stand. Well, you can tell he thought he was onside here, but the assistant, I think, got it absolutely right. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Able to skip past his man. Now defending always has to be a team effort. Good piece of covering. Room now out on the wing. Happy to take on the shot. And the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty given. This to open the scoring here. Still a chance. And the referee has given them a corner. deliver it with accuracy and they couldn't take advantage of the chance oh good work to deny the opportunity well the crowd are driving their team on here they're surely going to score soon Can someone get on the end of this? Not away completely. And that is going to be a free kick. Karen. 
Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. Can they hit on the break? It did look on for them, but not to be. Benza. Now, options are plenty. Oh, good save. said and done and simple for the keeper well he's made a real mess of that hasn't he what a chance that was really getting stuck in and they will be awarded a free kick for that well, the referee deciding that it didn't warrant a yellow card being handed out Silva. Real chance. And no worries for the goalkeeper. Can he find the right pass? Determined defending. Well, the hosts have completely bossed the game in the last 15 minutes and have looked great going forward. They just need to take one of the chances they've created to get themselves ahead today. Now can they win back possession and carve out another chance for themselves? And intercepts again. Bobby's forward and the break looks on. Could nudge in front. Oh, body in the way, crucially. Will this corner bear fruit for them? Well, this is a big moment, and don't these fans know it? <laughs> Trying to deliver it accurately. Not all that convincing defensively. And a significant block following that cross. <laughs> Who can they pick out? Mopping up defensively. Fantastic work to thwart the danger. And so it is, the first half story has been written. underway once more and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end using his strength to shield the ball well it looked highly promising but they got nothing out of it well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Well, 
Moving into the advanced position. Must take the lead here. Back underway, 1-0 it is. Ashimeru. Murillo. Majid Ashimeru. Fabio Silva. He read the situation defensively and did his job. This might be ideal for the counter. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. Amuzu. Well, he could really get at the opposition. Well, that pass easy on the eye. It was a menacing attack, but tidied up. And Bensa. Just not looking confident in possession. Yari for Skarin. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. Defenders need to cover, and just like that, the counter-attack comes to an end. <laughs> Yari for Skarin. Leo Repailov. Still trailing, but they're upping the pressure. Oh, in with a chance! Well, the keeper performing brilliantly. Well, that's just incredible. He reacted so quickly there. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. So the corner played into the box. Not away completely. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Could be a chance to break here. He's protecting it well. Just ten minutes remaining here. And teammates to play it to. So almost at full time, and the home side on course to eke out a narrow win. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, they need to hold on here. Not long left now, but you have to say they've defended really well up to this point. And I just can't see them conceding now. This will be a really good win if it stays like this. Well, beating his opponent. Good defending in the end and danger averted for now. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Yari for Skarin. Not the pass he had in mind. Can they fashion something? They need a goal. Pressure exerted, but he keeps the ball. The referee blows for full time. It ends at a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Well, Derek, it was a tight game. Both sides had their moments and chances, but overall, they just about shaded it. A well-earned victory. And in the final analysis, a really positive performance from this man, Stuart. Well, he was excellent today, and he gave them that all-important lead. They just struggled to cope with him. His movement was so clever.